In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to forward an entire conversation, also known as an email chain, in Outlook. This is a super handy skill to have, especially if you need to keep everyone on the same page or share a detailed discussion with someone new. So let's dive right in. First things first, you'll need to head over to the Microsoft Outlook page. Once you're there, look for the sign in button and give it a click. This will take you to the sign in page where you'll now be prompted to enter your login details. Ensure you type in your email and password accurately as this will grant you access to your Outlook account. After you've done that, simply click next to proceed. Now that you're logged in, you'll find yourself on the Outlook dashboard. Here, we'll want to navigate to your inbox where all your emails are stored. This is where you'll locate the conversation or email chain you wish to forward. It might take a bit of scrolling if it's an older conversation, but once you find the email thread you're looking for, go ahead and select it. With the email chain selected, turn your attention to the right corner of the mail. What you're looking for is the forward option. Click on this and as you do, you'll notice it automatically selects the most recent message in the thread. The great thing about this is that clicking forward from the latest message ensures the entire conversation history is included when you send it. That way, the recipient will see all previous emails in the chain in chronological order, making it easy for them to follow the discussion from start to finish. Lastly, all you need to do is enter the email address of the person you want to send this conversation to. Make sure it's typed correctly to avoid any delivery issues. Now, you're ready to hit send. It's really as straightforward as that you've successfully forwarded an entire conversation in Outlook. By following these steps, you can easily share important email threads with colleagues or friends, ensuring everyone stays informed and nothing gets lost in translation. Don't forget, clear and effective communication is key, especially through emails. Thanks for watching and I hope you found this guide helpful. If you have any questions or would like to see more tutorials like this one, feel free to let us know. Have a great day.